Hi, I'm Tony Dunst, and welcome to my WPT Montreal Daily Grind. So when I'm on the road and uh, I wake up, the first thing I like to do is try and get a little bit of food into my system and then get down to the gym. Uh, I really like to get it out of the way at the beginning of my day. Uh, even though I try and stay active, I never really enjoy working out. So it's nice to think that I get kind of the hardest part of the day off, out of the way straight, straight out of the morning. So on the days off that I have from the tournaments, uh, the first thing I like to do once I settle back into my room after the gym is to start doing some daily fantasy sports uh, homework, research, uh, check out the numbers and the prices of the players that week. Um, almost all of the games I play now are on DraftKings. Uh, predominantly I play in the NFL games, a little bit of their NBA and college football, but really NFL is the sport I feel the most comfortable with and the most knowledgeable about. And it's also the game where they have the largest tournaments. I mean, every week, you know, they're having a tournament that's going to pay a million dollars to first prize. And even at the height of online poker's popularity, we didn't see anything that big. So I think there's some really big upside in uh, daily fantasy sports, and it's just a ton of fun for me. So I was really excited when I heard that someone created a way to make money off that. And although I technically haven't made any money off daily fantasy sports yet, um, I'll continue to try. Uh, after I finish up my daily fantasy sports research, I like to move on to playing some online poker, um, especially on the weekends. There's some really good tournaments that go on at Party Poker, and uh, I'll log on there. I'll usually play the larger sequence of tournaments that they have right in the sort of prime time, which typically means you know Sunday morning, Sunday afternoons when they have the biggest ones and biggest guarantees. There's also some good stuff that goes on on Saturday and in the afternoon and evening during the week. Uh, online poker is a pretty pretty nice way to spend the day and uh, make some money in the process if uh, if you run good that day. Then when I finish up with everything I'm playing online that day, uh, I like to go get some live poker in. I usually head out to a playground poker club over in Kahnawake, and uh, it's really cool because it's a combination of being able to grind, play some of the live cash games, and then also hang out because it's actually a very social setting for a card room. They've got a nice bar and restaurant there. The you know, staff there is really friendly, great looking, as everyone knows. So uh, there's a lot to like about going down there in a lot of my evenings. Here in Montreal, I just end up at Playground. And then when all the poker and gambling is finished for the day, uh, I really like to make a point of exploring the cities that we visit. I think a lot of poker players almost miss out on that. They show up and they grind everything that they're supposed to be working on really hard, but they forget to let themselves experience a new city uh, and to get out and explore. So, you know, in a way, I'll even grind that. I'll walk, you know, I'll walk the streets for, for miles just to get a sense of the place, try and, you know, learn my directions. Um, I'll go for, you know, coffee, breakfast, and all kinds of different places in the city. I'll try and meet the locals and have them show me around. And uh, especially like to get out and experience the fine dining that uh, some of these great cities that we visit has to offer. So, you know, whenever I can get a good group together for that, I try and make it happen.